Hello. How's it going? I'm here. I made it. Yeah. Hip hip hooray for the normal laptop. I'm actually going to take my hair down and I'm hoping that it'll dry. <laughs> it's very, it's very damp. Guess I could have used the hairdryer, but you know, here we go. What can you do? <laughs> so now here's what I can do is like give it sort of the half half seas pin here. There we go. That'll work. This is actually a, a, a beauty channel. I kind of need two pins. Surely I have another pin. Just somewhere. No, maybe not. Okay, well, that's fine. Ah. Beauty stream. That's me. Every stream's a beauty stream with looks these good. <laughs> Um, okay. Come on up. Hi, kitty. Come on up. Welcome. Welcome up. Come on up. She has to smash the chair before she can get up. Come on up. There we go. There she is. Here. Pop, pop, pop.
Oh, she's just looking at... She's watching the cords move. <laughs> ah, I'm punching the mic. Oh my god. Let's get this back. There we go. Are you attacking? Oh no! I'll put that in my shirt where she can't get it. Huh. <sighs> okay. How you doing? How's it going? Ow! Don't bite me. You big weirdo. <laughs> this music feels... It's okie dokie. You had bonkers dreams? I don't remember my dreams this time. for work yeah um i'm gonna have to work today which i don't really believe in weekend work but sometimes it just happens to you whether you believe in it or not to be fair i mean i could i could not do that i could just fuck around like i do every weekend but you know um we're already behind the timeline for the report, Rick has put in a lot of a lot of hours, uh, and I feel like, out of respect for that, his his hard work just attempting to stay even close to the time loan that we were given. Um, I'd like to I'd like to put in that extra time for him, if if for no one else. Okay. Hi, cat. She's so happy. I kind of want to finish my smoothie before I start Bloodborne. So we're just going to sit here until I'm done with it. You know, I thought Lady Maria would be harder for me. Like, not that it was super easy or anything, but I just expected it to be more of a challenge than it ended up being. Hey, Greg. Okay, I need a second pin. The cat's... Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, excuse me, miss. I'll be right back. Um, what am I talking about? I was just complaining that I'm going to work this weekend a little bit. Um, but also saying that I think it's, I think it's good. I'm glad I'm doing it. I just also am grumpy about it. <laughs> and then I was also saying... I was surprised that um, Maria wasn't, Lady Maria wasn't more of a challenge. Because I felt like she was a <sighs> challenging, but um, less challenging than I expected. You know? Mm. Yeah, that's also how I feel about... 95 corporate jobs. Also, I just realized my light is just not on. There we go. Um, but every once in a while, with these reports and things like that, I work a little extra. That's okay. Get away from me. You're just a little too close, this camera. Oh my god. 
This is what I get for not coming prepared. I'm... <laughs> yeah, I plowed through. I'm hoping I can plow through some more fights today. I want more Bloodborne plowing, please. This is delicious. This is such a tasty smoothie. I can never... I don't know how I feel about chia seeds. <laughs> I think they're good in something like this. But, um, see, and now it's off. Like, the angle is off. I want... I want the vertical lines in the background to be vertical. Or, like, as vertical as possible on, on stream as well. That's what I get. That's what I get for trying to show you the cat. Smoothie King! That's me. There we go. I feel like, um... Yeah, the music... I think the music was down too low. Is it better now? That better? Let me know. Maybe more like that. No? Is that too high? I don't know. No one knows. Keep me posted. <laughs> Turns out this is the hardest part of the streaming. It's just knowing what the volume should be. The volume is great. Okay, thanks. I guess really it's like, I don't know how I feel about chia pudding. I can't tell if I like it or not. But like in something like this, it's good. A dangerous thing. What, too much fiber? pudding. So yummy or so gross. Yeah. And I think that's kind of the thing is like, I think I also am not sure how I feel about coconut milk. And I was trying a recipe that was coconut milk based. And it was just like too, too much coconut, too much chia and just like made me sick a couple times. You know what I mean? And then I was like, mm, I don't want to make that. And so now when I see a chia pudding, I'm like, is that going to be tasty or is it going to make me sick? <laughs> it's like when you eat um, like a fruit while you have the flu or something and then you can never eat it again. I had like the opposite of that one time. I got so sick, like violently ill while I was staying at a, at a friend's house, like a family friend, but also a friend of mine. Um, and I don't even remember why I was staying there, but like my mom was not around. She was, um, she was not in town, but I was, and I was staying with a family friend. Um, and I went to bed totally normal the first night, woke up, next morning not good like big mess not good you know what i mean so someone else's mom had to take care of me while i was like had i've never had a like a stomach bug or like a flu that bad like i think it wasn't just a stomach bug like i think it was the flu with just like a lot of stomach stuff happening I was like, this is so, like, this sucks so much. Cause I was like 14 or something too. But I just like couldn't, like I was so sick. I couldn't take care of myself. Um, 
And I felt so bad, like, <laughs> being a guest. <laughs> it was like waking up shitting, you know what I mean? When you're like, whoa, like this is not good. Um, and it took a few days for me to get better. And I did not have an appetite because I was very ill. Um, and then I finally started feeling better. And the only thing I wanted to eat was like nectarines or like peaches. I was like, I am desperately hungry, but only for this fruit. Like it's the only thing that sounds good. Uh, and she was able to find some for me. <laughs> and um, I love nectarines. I love them a lot. And I don't know if I loved them as much before that happened. Like they were my, my like sucker, you know, my manna in the desert. <laughs> After like three to four days of not really being able to eat anything. So that was wild. Hmm, I need to grab my medicine real quick. It was my sucker! Yeah. You can't think of a situation with a similar thing? Yeah, I don't think that's a common experience. Like, I've never heard people be like, Oh, you know when you have a craving for a food while you're sick and then you love it? It's, it doesn't seem to be a norm. So I think that was just like a, a weird thing my body did. But yeah, having having to have someone else, like someone who's not related to you, take care of you when you're doing that bad is such a nightmare. You got really sick at Disneyland Paris on the first day and had to spend this the next day with a fever at the hotel. Oh no. Did you get to go to Disneyland at all? Or did you just have to stay in the hotel the whole time? Because that sucks. Like, I think Disneyland is a little overrated in that you end up spending a lot of time just standing around. Um, but it's still very fun. I've gone, I went once to the one in Anaheim with my family on one of my cousin's trips. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> no one wanted to hang out with me. did go to Disney World once when you were 12 and had an amazing time. Yeah, like, I don't love Disney as a corporation. I think some of their stuff is good and some of it is less than good. Uh, but going to Disneyland is fun. Like, I think, I think there's no getting around it. You're like, I am gonna stand in a line for several hours uh, and it's still gonna be worth it. I don't know. Um, went two or three times when you lived in San Diego. Yeah, I mean, there you're just like right next door. And it was, I mean, I had an extra fun time because I, I really, I love all my cousins. They're so cool. Um, though at that point I was still young enough. So my cousins as a crew, there's kind of like the older set and the younger set. And I'm at the top of the younger set. <laughs> um, and then there's like me and Jeff are like one year apart and then our younger cousin is like a few like a couple years younger than us i think or a couple years younger than jeff and then there's like a couple years and then the next oldest right so we would often get kind of split up into like older younger um which as you can imagine i was like but i want to hang out with my cool older cousins so there was like one day where they were like okay fine dude go hang out with your older cousins just don't start a riot with your sibling okay because that was part of it too is like we ended up splitting older younger because a lot of times there was fighting if because <laughs> if it was an older set there was two older siblings who were in that set together but like the the main aggression would be split up if we did it older younger so 
But I also had a really wonderful, like one of my happiest memories is like, that's a bit extreme, but like a lovely memory I have from that trip uh, was going with Jeff, who's one year younger than me, just around the the like sci-fi land of the park, um, kind of just in the last like hour before it closed. And we just like went and we rode like Space Mountain and we got dip and dots and we just like hung out and chatted. Um, and it, it was just really nice. Like, I don't, I don't know how he felt about it, but I still feel like I'm like, man, remember that time I really got to bond with Jeff? That was so cool. He's great. Um, it's so good at night. Yeah, it was very cool. I felt very cool. I was not, objectively speaking, but like, <laughs> I think that's part of it too. I was like, you know, hang out with my cool cousin and feel really cool because no one's there and it's like just me, <laughs> just me and my cuz and my uncle who's like kind of trailing nearby. Um, our uncle would, so for those trips, my grandma would get all their cousins together. It was like no parents allowed because again, too much yelling, don't like it. Um, the two, the aunt and uncle without kids would come and be like chaperones, right, with, with my grandma. Rudy would always also bring his Kindle. Um, so at any given moment, you could turn around and Rudy would have just like found a bench and be like reading his Kindle. Uh, and I think that's also really fun <laughs> as, <laughs> as your Disneyland aesthetic is like... Yeah, we're all in line and I'm reading my Kindle. <laughs> okay, I have to go grab my pills and then let's play some Bloodborne, huh? One second. Actually, we'll just do a little... Yeah, it is a wise move. Rudy's a wise guy. <laughs> ah, we got a wise guy, huh? Okay. <clears throat> um, okay, so the real question is, is the game screen gonna be busted right now? Sometimes when I first add it, it looks wild, but it looks like we're good, actually. Yeah, it looks like we're good. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Get that jazz out of here. <laughs> um, okay, so here's the plan, is I'm gonna see how I'm gonna try to see how far I can get today. And if it seems like I could potentially finish this weekend, I'm just gonna to try to finish this weekend. Um, and if it seems like that is not the case, then we'll probably play something different tomorrow to just kind of mix it up. And that's, and that's the plan.
Okay. There we go. Okay, what are what's going on? Okay, we've got an orphan. I can't hear this. Why can't I hear this? There we go. Okay, there it is. <clears throat> hmm. So the real question is, do we start with the orphan? Or do we start with Lawrence? I guess I'm here, so... May as well. <laughs> Can't hurt. Probably. Hello. Excuse me. <laughs> okay. Last set before the fight. <laughs> The smoothie is just really changing the game today. Okay. Hello? What's in there? Um, it's a pretty simple smoothie. It's non-fat milk and two bananas. Oh, hello. Oh, hello again. Whoa! Wow. Good, good work, orphan. Um, yeah, it is some non-fat milk, two bananas, a cup of frozen berry mix, and a few tablespoons of chia seeds. And it's really tasty. Yeah, he really, he nailed it. Good job, efficient. Yeah, this morning, hmm, yesterday and then tonight, I'm looking after the dogs and cats at a friend's place. So this morning I got up, went to karate, but I didn't eat breakfast first. Um, and if I had been at home, I might have just like eaten some peanut butter, but the only peanut butter there was like the peanut butter that's for giving the dog the pill. And I feel like, I don't know to what extent the dog and peanut butter crossover exists. Do you know what I mean? Um, so I opted to not eat that and instead had an apple. But it turns out an apple doesn't keep you going that long after your intense exercise. So, you know, we made it, but okay, let's, let's see here. Hi there, buddy. Let's try it again. Doom. Cannot get the guy with a visceral. I I whiffed it, I whiffed it, and he whiffed me. Arr! Oh right, now I'm remembering why I turned it down before. It's because he's screaming the whole time. Here, I'm turning that back down for you. <laughs> Shout out to the person who was like, you're not as overleveled as you're worried you are. <laughs> it's true. I'm not.
Um, I like that you're sending me that message, like, sneaky on the side, Connor. <laughs> no one can know. No one can know that I want to watch anime. Your secret's out. We all know. Oh, Donzo. Donzo! Okay. <laughs> um, I mean, Fruits Basket is uh, famous for a reason. It's good. It's nice. magic trick at teaching you to read. We need one of those for Japanese. I think the boba straw is like good for most of the smoothie but now I'm down at the bottom and there's like not an insignificant chunk of smoothie left and it's just not it's just not working, you know? I'm almost done. I'm just trying to finish it. Um, the fuck am I drinking? It's a smoothie. I'm drinking a breakfast smoothie. Or trying to finish drinking it, rather, more than anything. There, we're done. We did it. Um, Matrix style downloading the intel into your brain. Wow. What's the book? Also, hello. Welcome in, uh, Wablanco. <laughs> I tried to call you Leblanco, but that's not it. I do eat brunches. When I can. I mean, usually I just eat breakfast, but... Hello. No, it's not. It doesn't work. I cannot parry this man to save my life. I was greedy about it. I really was. Okay. He's throwing me onto the ceiling. Okay, okay. That's fine. I've got tricks too. Don't throw that at me. Gross. Haha. <laughs> Oh my god, we've got like a little tumbling act going. Oh, I missed. Embarrassing. Okay. He is so twisty. The man flips around. I 
Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Yeah, it, I think that's what happened. Is is the Spanish? Though I mean, that's not the gender is incorrect there, but that's fine. Okay, um, well, we gotta go get more vials. Yeah, take me home. Hmm. Okay. Um, do I have... Any money? Oh, though I guess there's also... What do I have in the storage? Now that I know it doesn't all refill, I'm... So many bullets, so many knives. Yeah, I don't need any of that. Okay. What about the blood gem situation? Are we? Yeah, no, we, we fixed that just recently. Can I fortify this anymore? I think it's done. Okay, well. Hello. <laughs> Gonna have to grind soon. Okay. Um, let's try Lawrence. Ah, oh no, but now I have the wrong blood gem for him. Because um, that special one is like, I think it's like plus 25 against kin, minus 25 against beasts, which is going to be bad for this situation. So never mind. Take me back home again. Um, I guess I could switch. I could use a different weapon, but this one's the most upgraded, so... You know. <laughs> There's what is what's stopping me? Okay. <sighs> okay, blood gems. Nope. What? Oh, it's not as bad against. Okay, that's good. I wonder if I have any of that up beast attack. No. I guess this one, but I don't really need slow poison. <laughs> Oh, that's kind of nice. I might just find the one that has the highest attack addition. Oh, 
Or I could do this. This could be fun. Let's see. I don't know if I'll even... Let's see how much of a difference it even makes, you know? Because that's not very much compared to my whole health bar. Um, okay. <clears throat> okay. Oh, and I didn't change the category. One second. Okay. Now we're now we're updated. A little late, but not... French for reading. Well, they really named it the right thing, didn't they? It's true. Lawrence is like, I thought we had a date. Yeah, get out of here. Usually it doesn't go as well with the, with the beasts there. Let me in. Thank you. I'm busy. <laughs> I'm busy. I don't want to talk to you. Okay, we need some anti-fire garb. Mm, okay, let's see here. Yeah, okay. That's my, that's my fireman's hood. Um... there a different this one oh that one's kind of better huh yeah no I'm, I'm good okay and then this is fire 100 which is pretty good but you just can't you can't beat the chard oh there's the bone ash Eh, I'm fine. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, it's not much of an outfit. Actually, I take that back. This is a big look for an outfit. Whoa. I didn't shoot. Okay. Oh, okay. Um doing his little little walks. I swear I am just like, I can't see where I'm at. Okay. Doing his little, little crouch walk there. I love it. I love it.
I just realized I've been only using heavy attack. <laughs> no, okay, okay, okay. This fight would be a lot better if the frame rates wouldn't freak out. Um, I wonder if there's a way to improve that. Had special eyes? Yeah. Sure did. Um... Mm, better frame rates for Lawrence Bloodborne. I don't know. People have a variety of opinions on the internet, but no one has any helpful information to share. So, oh well. Never mind. Here we go. I guess I'll just, I'll just do my best. <laughs> I don't really need to jump there, but I keep doing it anyway. drop anything anything good no nothing today okay I don't think I can parry him I can't tell if I'm hitting him or not. There we go. Okay, okay. I'm gonna need you to chill it out a little bit. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm super on fire. Okay. Well, until he started doing that, it was going pretty well. Um, we're like a third of the way. Ooh. 
I wonder also if I could try using... I'll try the blood pellets. I haven't been hitting him very much, to be honest. Um, which isn't great, but maybe I can hit him more. My back is irritated. Oh, maybe I do need to jump. Okay, well. Oh well. Stop it. I'm busy. Okay, let's try it. Let me in. Okay, I'm I'm dead. <laughs> hmm, not particularly better. I don't yeah, I don't think I'm hitting him enough to get any of the beast build up. So which is another problem. But... No. Sorry, the computer has a lot to say to me. Let me just... One second. Okay. A little stretch. Okie dokie. Just you, huh? I'm sorry, could I just come in? Stop that. Let me in. I'm trying to get in. Oh my god. This is... Okay, this is not the run. Dude. Fuck off. <laughs> Leave me alone. Oh no, okay.
Mm. Yeah, the explosion is really something, isn't it? Just doing a little dance together here. Oh, he got me. I was trying to roll. Come on, let me go. It's true, he is a hugger. Too close. Okay, that's fine. What if I just threw. <laughs> what if I just threw knives at his head? You know? Oh, he got me. Pop. I'm gonna throw knives at his head. <laughs> it's gonna be great. You'll see. You'll see how well it works. He's so intimidating, but if you stay away... Yeah, he is plotting, and yet. Um, and yet. Okay, let's see here. This is... Get out of here. Useless. I have a poison knife. Ooh. Okay, I don't have... I don't have what I need. Gotta go back. That's fine. I wonder where my cat is. <laughs> yes, okay. Please, 20. Um, let's do a quick run through Yarnum for some blood vials, you know? The classic run, yeah. Did they just replace the battery completely? Pop. Nope, nothing for me, huh? Hmm. Oh, just just one. Pop. Yeah, you think so? Mm. Nice.
What a what a beautiful Yarnum day. Here it comes. Ta da. Anybody left? There's usually one guy left. I guess not this time. Good good bowl. Good job. That's a strike. Anything? No? Oh, and a bone shard. Well, that's not what I wanted. Okay. Got an ad. Um, well, if it's an ad, let me take a second and try to stretch my back a little bit. Um, oh, oh, not like that. Okay, yeah, give me one second. Just do a little BRB. Okay. Okay, I'm back. Um, you know, I can't be the only one who thinks stretching feels bad, right? Like, I, I feel like everyone always talks about how nice stretching feels. <laughs> I have to really make myself do it. It feels bad. Is that just me? You're out of practice with it. Oh, so is it like if you stretch regularly, it starts feeling good and I've just never gotten there? <laughs> I've just never stretched enough to enjoy it? Interesting. Huh. <laughs> well, you learn something new every day. <laughs> uh, 
I see. Yeah, it's interesting because for the karate classes, like, there's like a little warm up segment, but it is like in the boxing classes, we would do a warm up that was like we would do kind of a dynamic stretching warm up and then we would do like essentially like a hit workout as our warm up. <laughs> And then we would do the boxing stuff. Um, and then like some more stretching briefly at the end. Usually very briefly. Sometimes it was just like, okay, class is over. If you want to stretch, you can. Um, here they do like a little, little warm up routine that's like... There's like a, a level of dynamic stretching to it, but it's feels more like just like shaking the shaking the sleepies out. Like it's not it doesn't feel like it's really preparing me for exercise in the way that I kind of want it to. But you're also kind of supposed to come early and like practice some things. But you're not supposed to stretch on the deck. So it's, it feels kind of mixed messages, you know what I mean? Like they're like, you can't stretch, but we're not really gonna warm you up. So like, come ahead and get the things you need done, but don't do it in the room. <laughs> if you wanna stretch, do it in the hallway or something. Get out of here with that bullshit. That is not a quote, but that's how I felt about like, okay, well. What do you do if you have to wait for an hour? You just like some sit-ups or you just kind of stand around. You could always just go watch them closely. That might speed them up a little bit. It's a hot tip, hot exercise tip. Well, okay, I don't feel that I'm <laughs> uh, Automata thinks Dumbbell might be bullying. <laughs> Bless its heart. <laughs> oh, hey. You're in injury land. Oh, no. Hey. Yeah, get out here. Yeah, it did not. But at least he gave me three blood vials, so that kind of makes up for it, actually. Oh no! That sucks. I'm sorry to hear that. Now you can only do Pilates. <laughs> Pilates only. I'm, I'm like not even looking. <laughs> Turns out it's really hard to drive your little guy when you're not looking at the, the actual game. Okay, here we go. Let's focus, shall we? Maybe. Um, I don't think the health regen is... I mean, I guess now I'm seeing it. But it doesn't feel really worth it to have it take a slot. What do you got? You got blood too? Yo, y'all got blood up in here? Oh, heck. The fence guy is too far away from here. I guess... Yeah, I guess I could go to the church and then... Oh my god, seriously? You... you... suck. I hate you. <laughs> um, 
Yeah, I guess I guess I could just go to that chapel and then run through and and kill him on my way. It's like, do I wait for it to inch up? It's so slow. But I don't want to use a whole vial on it. I guess I could I could go home now and use my 3000 echoes that I'll otherwise lose to just buy some. I don't know. I'm just going to go in. It's fine. Oh no. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Roasted. Okay. That's fine. Hmm. You can play fence with the camp, the camp dog. What? Who's the camp dog? How'd you get that dog? You can lure a dog to your camp. I see. We are trying to make friends in, uh, in Minecraft with a dog. Oh no! Oh no! I'm fine. Okay. <laughs> Get out of here. Can you, can we, okay, there we go. <laughs> okay. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. It's going bad, it's going bad. I don't like when I bonk into him and then get stuck. Okay, please stop. Okay, extra now with more fires. No. What are you doing? <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no.
Oh no, I forgot. I forgot to equip all my knives. I had a knife plan, didn't I? What are you doing? Yo, dude. Okay, maybe I can... Okay, well, they don't do very much. Don't grab me. I don't want that. Stop that. What, am I supposed to just bop you on the head? You gonna jump at me? Is that the situation? Jump at me. I'll bop you on the head. Or not. Oh, I'm dying. Oh, oh. Where am I? What's happening? Okay. Oh my goodness. Open the menu mid. <laughs> yeah. Woof. Uh. It's, you know, pretty good run in terms of staying alive, but didn't do that much damage to be, if we're being honest with ourselves. So I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the other rock back on, the one that just helps with physical damage. I'm also gonna find out if he's weak to anything. Let's see here. Oh no. Is Lawrence the first vicar weak to anything? Weak to physical damage as well as bolt and arcane. Okay. Though someone is kind of, people are disagreeing with that. Bolt. I see. So it's less than <laughs> um, less that he has a weakness and more that his resistances are a little lower uh, for, for physical blood bolt and arcane. Interesting. Mm. Oh. And it looks like he's weaker to serrated. Yeah, it does make sense since he is a beast. So maybe, I mean, what have I got that's more serrated? I mean, a ton of ton of stuff, right? But like, what have I got that's serrated and also does good damage, I guess is my question. Um, hmm. 
I could try giving him the old saw. We could try hitting him with a saw. Because I could also try doing that and the beast blood pellet. Because I was like, I can't, I'm like not hitting him enough times. And that's a crowd favorite. You know, and now I'm thinking, I think we, I think one of the people we were watching did that too. So maybe that's, maybe I'm not even having this idea on my own. Um, I need money. Shoot. I got none. Aw, oh, shoot. What have I got? Anything? One money, please. Let's, let's try it. I'm also kind of interested in this um, beast cutter. A D. This is better strength scaling. It's like the boom hammer, probably not the one. It's a big strat to have it. That makes sense. <laughs> okay, well, you know, look. I ain't proud. I'll try the classic. Um, they don't have enough twin bloodstone shards. Can I buy that from anyone? Hey, anyone got a, a twin bloodstone shard? How about you guys? You got any? Yes, is the answer. I don't, I'm not insightful enough, I think. Let's just get two. I think I need four though. And maybe I had one. So what's, wait, what? Oh, I need five. Oh, okay. What, what about, can I buy them with money or only with insight? That's the other question. Hello. Oh, I can buy them, but they're too expensive. Hmm. How do I get more insight? Is there just like a limited amount in the whole game? No. I do not. Um, I could go farm the pigs and buy it with money. Cause I could get one more. I don't want to use all my insight. Okay. <laughs> Is this a Wendy's? I don't know. Hard to say. <laughs> Hard to say. So, okay. So I still need one more and it costs, I think it was 10,000, right? So that's, that's not too bad. Let's go kill a couple of pigs and just see how it goes. Okay. Yeah, this is a good, this is a good plan. It's gonna go fine. I gotta say, Part of me is like, do I, am I going to finish the Orphan of Koss? He is t so hectic. Hello.
Wow. Okay, that went that went pretty well. And that's a lot of vials. Okay, we'll just do a little run through here. Um Was almost kind of bad. <laughs> okay. Though, you know, for a pig with so many eyeballs, this guy did not see me. Wow, I am just not learning, am I? <laughs> I guess I just thought that he would stop doing the same thing at some point, and I, I was wrong. He found a strat, it was working for him. He said, I don't have to do anything else. I can do this all day. Yeah, exactly. How's it going, Zash? How are you? Hello, boys. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was not, that was not it. That wasn't it at all. alive oh no I understand <laughs> um Nicholas host the Waffle House hell yeah that's what I like to hear okay so let's just use a hunter's mark um I'm doing okay I would say you know this morning was pretty hectic just in terms of the logistics weren't how I wanted them to be um but I feel like I'm on the right track now I'm gonna need to do some extra work this weekend, but I don't think it's gonna take both days. I think I'm gonna bust it out this afternoon, send it to the SME, um, and then and then have a, a very chill evening and tomorrow, you know? That's my plan. We love an SME. <laughs> So, I don't know, I mean, it depends what what situation you work in, right? But like, <clears throat> I'm finding in corporate America, at least, um, a lot of times the people who are reviewing things are not able to use their imagination or like maybe the opposite of that. They're not able to like suspend their their design disbelief to just like read the content right like you're sending them something to say hey do you approve of the the words on this page and they'll sometimes come back and be like this looks bad is it gonna look like this these charts look bad can we get better charts and you're like buddy like once the charts are approved we will build them. We will make beautiful charts for you. Wonderful charts. But for now, it's going to be bad chart city. Like, <laughs> it takes time to make the pretty version. 
Um, so I spent a good chunk of my time on Friday, yesterday, just formatting a Word document to be marginally more attractive so that when we send it, uh, so that when we send it to the, the head of the business, she's not just like, but this looks bad on my eyeballs. I can't read it. What does it matter how pretty they are if they communicate? That's a great question. It's um, really getting at the heart of the marketing experience. But uh, unfortunately, I think a lot of times the thing that charts communicate to people is, does this look good or not? And they don't actually read the graph or chart. <laughs> um, in my experience, this is the case. What am I looking for? I'm looking for twin bloodstone shards. I'll take two for now. Thank you. They're like, well, if the graph looks nice, I believe you. And if the graph looks bad, I don't believe you. Okay, so I need eight bloodstone shards now. So this is this is a losing game. How <laughs> Yeah. You've seen it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and sometimes it's like we make them pretty and it um, is in fact, I think, harder to see the actual data, right? Like. Yeah, right, like, um, our, our designers love to make those donut charts, you know, where it's kind of like a pie graph, but there's a hole in the middle. Um, I think those are kind of a bad graph. Like, <laughs> that's a bad graph. It looks fun. I don't think it's good, though. I think it starts doing, like, volume tricks on your eyes, you know? Um, can I buy any more of this? No. Yes. I can get three, which... Uh, fun news about getting three of these. It's not eight. So I don't know. Key data inside the donut. Yeah, that's true. That can be fun. I just think sometimes we use them to like jazz it up a little in situations where something else would probably be better. Um, though I like them more than I like those vertical stack ones, you know what I'm talking about? Where it's like, you know, start of a, a pie chart, they've made like chunks of a vertical bar. I don't like that. But that I partially have beef with because um, it starts just getting hard to read if the sections are small and if you want it to like be organized consistently, like if you want the numbers in the whole time, I, I don't know. Yeah, that makes sense. I'll take it. Fair enough. You got me. Uh, I guess I could just kill them again. Just come through again. The rotted offering. Oh. Uh, but yeah, I guess, long story short, um, I'm good, but I'm a little annoyed that I am going to have to spend extra time doing extra work because uh, people have to only see pretty things or they reject them. <laughs> 
Especially like, I don't know, word is not good for decorating, you know? It's like, it is just not a design software. This might shock you. Okay, we've just got some fire boys left. Get, get out of here. Stop that. Labs. I guess I could just. Nope, I missed. Okay. Oh no, we've got another pig on the way. I'm gonna need you to die a little faster. Okay. Oh no. This is, this is truly a situation. Oh no. Okay, next time I'm using the knife. <laughs> oh no! That's okay. I need... I think I need more than a run's worth of echoes anyway, so... The moment in the anime? <laughs> ah yes, the anime. And the slice happens after. Yeah, okay, okay. I see what you mean now. Ah, uh, yes, that anime. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I swear to God, if you guys get me, I'm gonna be livid. No, no, no! <gasps> Too early? Oh no, 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 oh no! <laughs> no! Please, please heal! Oh my god. This is a nightmare. It's literally Mickalash's nightmare, and I'm in it. Okay. Now here we go. Oh no. There we go. Now we're now we're back. Wow. Huh. The screen is filled with gratuitous lines? Where? My screen? I know. I well, I kept trying to hit heal and then instead I was not doing that. Hey you. Stop it. Okay. Now we're in Pigtown. I apparently can't... Oh no. Oh, this guy comes back. Oh. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna run and hide. Uh. <laughs> Eek. Eek, run away. Okay. Where's other pig? I didn't realize it was like this.
There we go. Okay, much better. Much better. Come here. Oh, how did you... You did not get me. One more pig. Hello. Oh, he doesn't care. Oh, he does care. Oh, oh. There we go. Okay. Oh. Well. Part of me is like, is it even worth it? Do I even want to deal with these guys too? These guys kind of wick. Yeah, they 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 whoop my ass, you know, every time almost. Okay, okay, that wasn't too bad. Flanking, don't do that. <laughs> you suck. Okay. Okay. And again. Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. I like that I kind of just put it against my forehead. I just look at it real close, the hunter's mark, and it takes me home. Oopa! Yeah, oopa indeed. That makes sense. Oh wait, how many did I need? I think I need eight, which is how many I can buy. So that's good. <laughs> yeah, I need eight. Yeah, I always think about the um, talisman that says, like, Tailwind Max, and then the Max is in English. Should I keep going? Great. Um, blood gems for my saw.
Okay. That seems pretty good. <laughs> um... I see. <clears throat> Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's let's just waste a little more money. Good, good. And then I guess we put our beast pellet on. I have a I have a feeling this is gonna be a game changer. Gotta get those pro strats, you know. Yeah, okay. I mean, that would be great. I'd love a win. I've been doing a lot of running around losing, uh, so that would be nice. <laughs> I don't, I think those are, I mean, it's spelled with a U. Aren't those pronounced the same? Or are you just literally asking about the spelling? <clears throat> this guy, okay. Yeah, I think it's just with a U. Oh, I need to, like... This is not the same. <clears throat> oh no. Just, why not? Full health, let's do it. Traverse the fog. No, stop it. <laughs> okay. No, I'm dead. Okay. Well, <laughs> uh, I didn't melt him that time. So maybe next time. It's true. It is not the same as the axe. Oh. So, you know, the other day when I was like, I, I don't know if I just got a bunch of really strange acne or if I got a bunch of bug bites on my face. 100% definitely bug bites. Like, I think I just got a bunch of mosquito bites when I went out. Um, so now they have stopped being, like, huge big welts. <laughs> but now they're still itchy. So I'm really loving that for me. I'm loving this summer of can't go out without bug spray everywhere or else. Um, that's been fun. Okay. 
I see. I think it's... Is it slower than the axe? Hi, let me through, please. Oh my god. Please, let me... Just let me through. Thank you. Knock, knock. It's me. Oh, right. Of course. Stop it! Ah. Okay. Okay, this is going okay, though. If I don't get stuck in, like, <laughs> a weird death loop, it's going okay. Yeah, I feel like every time I'm trying to get away from him... I just get stuck in his fire blast. Yeah. You got any observations on this one? I'm just cleaning my... Uh, <laughs> cleaning my controller a little while, I think. Um... Be up close and get some shots in. Yeah, I mean, so that's the thing, right? Like, when I try to dodge sideways on those, it's also a problem. So that's part of why I was trying to dodge backwards. No, the dodge forward doesn't always work, is the thing. Like, and I think it's because when he swings, when he does that, like, big swipe... He does it, like, all the way around. And then also sometimes I try to dodge forward and I just end up getting stuck in his crotch. Like, his knees are so far out 
that I dodge how I normally would for a boss, and then instead I end up bonking his knee. So, I mean, maybe I need to dodge, like, sideways, sideways. I don't know. I could try that. But yeah, no, the dodging situation is not is not right. But I'm not... Like, I don't think it's as simple as dodging forward like it usually kind of tends to be. But I also could be... Um, just have the timing wrong for that, too. We'll see. We'll play with it. I mean, dodging to the side might help, like, just get me out of that, that circle. Get a little life back there. <laughs> you love him? I think he kind of sucks personally, but, uh, you know, maybe that's just me. Dang it. Every time. Yeah, maybe it is just dodging to the side. I got stuck on his knee that one, though. Oh, I ran out of beast hood? Okay. I'm gonna need to get more pellets if I want to do this. Oh, no. Sorry, what? No, I was jumping. Stop that, you big dolt. Oh. Oh no. I am not aiming at your body. Oh my god. Um. I wonder what he's doing here. I mean, he seems very kin. Kin related. So, oh, maybe they sent him to like keep him in the church, you know? <laughs> okay. We've got another ad break coming up in a few minutes. So I think I'm going to run up here and then um, hold off and, and go like get some more water, maybe some tea, uh, stretch my ankle because it's bugging me, that, you know, that sort of thing. Whoa.
Yeah, we can just stand here and look at each other for a minute. Let's see. Oh. Oh my bad. It's currently an ad break. It was I missed the the time when it was about to be. And now it'll be done soon. Okay. Well, I'll st I'm going to still do a little a little BRB. One second. Hello, I'm back. Um, I was just giving the kitty a little snuggle. <laughs> Wah, here she is. Bop. Boop. There's the girl. Oh. You gonna, are you gonna win? Are you gonna kill Lawrence? Like those big eyes. Cute. Yes, hello. 
Okay, we're having a little pet. We're having a little pet moment. Let's see if we can get you some of that. There we go. It's not perfect, but it's what I can give you. <laughs> there she is. Smash. She loves to smash. Yeah. Yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing? You are so tiny. Who made you the tiniest cat? Why are you so tiny? Smash. There she is. I keep meaning to add the the emotes to Discord too, because we can have them all on there. Um, I just need to make the time for it. Okay. Okay. Are you ready to fight? Huh? She says no. Snuggle, please. for mic smash. Oh, okay. Okay. She threw all my rings on the floor. And also put my ring dish in the trash. Thank you. Trying to do me a chomp. No chomps. Okay, okay. Please, please don't smash the mic. Don't smash the mic. Oh, here, you playful. Can you get it? Attack. There she goes. You nailed it. Okay, bye. She's like, 
well, my work here is done. <laughs> I smashed the mic. I caught the pen. Huh. All set. Okay. Um, back at it. Shall we? See, I get stuck on his foot. What the heck? Oh no. Oh, I'm I'm super dead. Okay. I was trying some things and it I wasn't paying attention to my health. Okay. Yeah, this guy does not have an abnormal fear of flame. Um, the man is not afraid of flame. Okay, here's what else. What if... I know we tried the bolt paper and it didn't do like a ton, but it didn't hurt, you know? Um, I don't think I want to use it yet because I feel like I'm at a point where I'm just wasting resources. I'm not like good enough yet. Dang it. I jumped a little too early. But um, could be the strat. It's like fire obviously is not gonna do it, so. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I've never had you guys do that before. Cheeky little blood gem. That wasn't what I meant to do. Oh no. Shoot. Okay. <sighs> yeah, it's sort of hard to not go right into the fire in this one. It's, this is my hot take. Everything's on fire. Oops. 
All fire. What do I... Oh no, I left my seltzer in the other room. Huh. I was like, maybe I'll get more water. And instead I just left the seltzer that I already had. Um, so that's good. Good, good. Hmm. <sighs> Okay, I figured it out. I just go to the left of the big ball. No, don't fight me, you big dingus. <laughs> it's fine. I don't know. Sure, why not? And then he does a little smash. Yeah. Not great. Not great. It was going well for a second there. Yeah, I mean, me neither. I also was not expecting that. I think also because the beast stuff makes you more vulnerable, right? So, you know. Couple attacks that hit really hard, yeah. Yeah, I'll take a vial. Nice. <laughs> yeah, that's my understanding too.
okay. That's unforge. <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no. I knew this was coming and yet I wasn't ready for it. What am I supposed to do about this? No, 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 no. Not into the lobby, you, you dang bat. Okay. Okay, we're, we're, we're oozing? We're cruising. We're cruising into the lava. Stop that. Stop it. I don't like it when you do that. <laughs> oh no. I got nothing. Uh. What do I have? Nothing. I got nothing. I just have to win or die. <laughs> Likely death. Oh, I'm dead. Okay. Oh, one of the lady's bloods. Oh no, I forgot about the lady's bloods. Okay, this time I'm gonna attach We've all had lava, but yeah, we've all been there. <laughs> who's oozing? Did I say who's oozing for a cruising? Because that feels familiar to me. <laughs> okay. Let me see if I can get some more. Um, ah, I see. Yeah, let me see if I can get some more beast blood pellets. I don't know how much they cost. I've never bought them before. <laughs> I mean, I know I have nothing right now, but let's see here. Can I not buy them? Oh. <laughs> yeah, no, I have no idea. I have no idea what I'm saying. Anything could come out of these mouths. These mouths. You have no idea where my second mouths are. Ha ha. Um, okay, well, do you give me a beast blood pellet? Where do I get beast blood? I get it here, and I got none. Can I sell to you? Like, just of yourself? Are you the queen? Who's the queen? I can sell items to you guys. There's a leaf. Where? What? Okay, let's... We're looking this up. I don't want to waste my time. Um... Where to get beast blood pellets? Dropped from scourge beasts and old yarnum. Um, 
where to get more insight. One point of insight for defeating a boss. Oh my gosh, okay. It's fine. Oh my god, there's so many ads. Okay, here we go, here we go. can have up to 99. Um, you get insight for some things. Oh, I can buy it from, okay, so it's just indirect. Let's see here. Hi guys. Y'all got any of that insight? No, they don't have any insight for me. This is a lie. It said that they would, it said that I could buy it from them, but I cannot buy it from them. So I guess I just have to go without the beast situation and that's, that's okay. I also have no, no nothing. So I guess I'll, here, we can just go to old Yarnum for a bit and, uh, farm scourge beasts, I guess. I don't know what a scourge beast is. I don't know what that is. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. I mean, worst case, I just get some echoes and uh, buy some blood, you know? Oh, you're super dead. Okay. Oh. Oh, hey. I didn't see you there. Everybody's dancing in the moonlight. Dancing in the moonlight. This is all trash. This is not what I want. Give me your orbs. Give me your orbs. Are you a scourge beast? I guess a scourge beast, huh? Get out of here. Nothing? No treats for me? Oh, you're still alive. Oh, you're a different one. Oh, 
are you guys the scourge beasts? You're you're giving me a scourge. So it could be. Is it a scourge or a scourge? That's the real question. No sleeping on the top. I see. Stop this. Who's who's there? Oh, it's you. Get out of here. You just just trying out the commands there? <laughs> Only I can BRB. Hello? What about maybe it's the yelling guys here? Oh, hey. And nobody has a single thing for me. Oh, they're all running over. Wow. It's uh, satisfying when you come back and just dis destroy everyone. <sighs> come on. No, that's not what I wanted. Uh. Maybe these are not the right guys. Or maybe the drop rate is low or something. I don't know. Pebble? Pebble.
I know your ways, you know? Maybe these guys are the scourge piece. Okay, these guys are the guys. We found them. <laughs> found them. A lot more bloodstone shards than I want. Okay, well, we've got one pellet. <sighs> Not very much insight. You know, Connor, maybe I can um, come help you with some bosses in the Chalice Dungeons so that I can get some more insight. can try okay sounding nice and confident there <laughs> you're rusty oh well it's okay I'm okay. <laughs> the chain whip boy? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean...
Oh no. I thought it was a beast blood pellet. I wasted it. Okay, wait. Oh, this is not a good. Oh, man. <laughs> My blood. My beautiful extra blood. The fool that I am. I didn't prepare. I thought I was prepared, but I was not. <laughs> oh. would love some lunch. It's fine. It's going great. Dang it. <laughs> it's going great. Okay. And that's blood. Don't love when that happens. Need to get my stamina back. Oh no! Oh no, he got me. Oh! Stop that! Hey. Whoa.
shoot. Oh no. Oh, that was too many, but that's okay. I'm in I'm in the lava. I'm in the lava. please <laughs> yay woohoo woo 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 <laughs> oh and now i get to hug a, the beast's embrace that's what he was doing he was just demonstrating for me beast's embrace incoming wow well that really was something wasn't it Got no blood vials, but I didn't have to use my Adriana blood, so that's great, because I can't get more. Okay, well, dang. I think um, that is a good note to end on for me today. I have to go eat something. Yeah, you missed the win. <laughs> um... Greg, that feels like similar energy to you going in and sacrificing yourself on the run where we win. A similar vibe, you know? But, uh... Yeah, you missed the big win, and also I think I'm gonna stop now. <laughs> you forgot! It was very funny. Um, so here's the question is like, do we do another Bloodborne tomorrow or do we do something else? Because so I'm going to be out of town next weekend and then I'm going to be in town. But on Saturday, I'm going to be doing like a, a later stream than usual. I'm going to do like an afternoon stream um, and then Sunday will be normal. I guess Thursday also, not this coming Thursday, but the one after will be normal. So yeah, we've got tomorrow's stream and then basically like a week off um, and then we're back and then there's another week off because I'm in, I'm going to a wedding. So we could do another attempt at the orphan tomorrow. We could try to make tomorrow orphan day. But I don't really see beating the orphan and also Garmin and also moon presence all in one day. That feels unlikely with the amount of time I usually do. Um, so the other thing was I thought maybe we could play some Ori and the Blind Forest as like just a little break, I guess. Um, so I don't know. I'll see... Maybe I'll ask in the Discord what people think would be the most interesting. Um, yeah, because we got some options. I mean, we could also do a Persona stream tomorrow and just, like, take it easy. Um, you'd be down for Ori? Yeah, I'm also excited to finish the bosses. But I feel like... I feel like I've just been playing so much Bloodborne stream and I just keep losing, you know? I mean, today we won, so that's great. 
Chairman and Moon presence are way easier than Orphan. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense. I have a feeling once I do get the Orphan, it'll I'll be able to kind of blast through Garmin and Moon Presence, but I don't know how long it's going to take me to get the Orphan. <laughs> so maybe what we can do is we could do like a split stream tomorrow where we do do some Orphan. Um, and then once, once I feel like I can't do more Bloodborne, we can just switch. Or maybe not can't, but like would like to kind of mix it up. We can just switch. So maybe we can do a two-parter. So hard and your fave. He loves to scream. <laughs> he has so much to say. The Whirly Gig saw truly was the move for Lawrence. It's like it was made for him. There were, there were, that one, you know, there were some messy moments there, but I felt pretty good about that run overall. Um, I think specifically, I really, hard not to jump in that lava. <laughs> I really jumped in the lava a lot. Um, that's okay, Doki. Okay, I'm going to call it for today, and I will, I think split stream tomorrow sounds good to me. So let's plan to do some Bloodborne and then start Ori and we'll just we'll just see how it goes. Hello, good evening. You're coming right at the end of uh, right at the end of the stream. Um, but welcome in and I hope you'll come by another day. Um, okay. I'm going to go eat lunch. And uh, y'all take care of yourselves. See you tomorrow. Thanks so much. Goodbye.